our society. You are the revolutionaries, and you should do that. Do you make what these flags are really about? In this capital, it's all about sometimes who can raise the highest money in the campaign or who got the highest stock in Wall Street. But that flag is what you represent in this country. This is what true Americans are about. Yes. And this is about this revolution to make a, a step for mankind that would last forever. Yes. Your mission lasts forever. Pittsburgh, he don't like to say he's a Pittsburgh Steelers fan. He, he forgot out the Pirates. He's a Philly fan. <laughs> I got to tell you, he's the author of that bill over in the Senate. And there's a guy named White from Indiana, PA, that's the chairman of the Insurance Committee. If anybody's from Indiana, PA, or Western PA, you need to pick it up and say to Mr. White, get off your back hind and report that bill out. Yes. Yeah. wants to move the bill, and some people of some other executive branch are saying, well, hold off. And we need to say to our friend Tony to move the bill and report it out. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Because it's about accountability. Nobody in America that's an elected official, nobody that's an elected official in this free society should be sitting on the sidelines in this revolution about health care reform. Yeah. This yeah. My friend Kevin McCarthy over here was running around the state running for a judge. He, he, he gets beat up all the time. But he stands for health care reform and health care for all Americans, yeah. for our children and seniors and everybody that's alive in this nation. And that's what we're about in this country. Let me tell you, workers in this country, people, I know you understand, I can tell you, you do understand after World War II, our allies and our nation, this country had a decision to make. What are we going to do about health care insurance, insurance for all of the world in America? Our allies elected to go similar to a single-payer system, a government-sponsored Italy, Germany, yeah. France, yeah. England, Switzerland, yeah. New Way, New Zealand, Australia, Canada. In this country, we decided to use it in a capitalistic form in a way that you get paid and we have health care out of productivity and work. If you work in this country after World War II, the mission and objective was to have health care through your productivity. The end cost is in the product. And we moved up and up and up and up till we had a large percent. Much more, two times as many percentage we have today covered by health care because of our productivity. And all of a sudden these guys in Wall Street woke up and said, Hey, that's our money. We don't need to make more calls. All we got to do is eliminate workers from having health care. We don't need to make more cars and more profit out of productivity. We just eliminate people and pensions. And that's where we are today. We have a major, major conflict of a society that was required to maintain their commitment, walking away from that commitment. 